Greetings, my friends. I'm the all-powerful Criswell. For years, I foretold the almost unbelievable, related the unreal, and proven it to be more than fact. We are all interested in the future because that is where you and I are going to spend the rest of our lives, whether we want to or not. So let us remember the past, honor the present, and be amused by the future. I predict that there will be a dramatic shift in the morals of the country. Moral leaders will criticize the Washington Monument as a phallic symbol corrupting the minds of our children. A law will be passed that demands the former national treasure be draped head to balls in fig leaves. The great states of Louisiana and Mississippi, not to be outdone, will quickly cover the Mississippi Delta with a giant pair of granny panties. While these changes will furnish short-term benefits such as increased popularity of Fig Newtons, these efforts at modesty will give rise to an unwholesome urban legend. When school children are asked to name the number one mystery of their generation, they will reply, just how big was Washington's monument? The question will be finally answered by digging up George Washington's corpse for a posthumous examination of his hands. You, you know what they say about big hands. Big hands, big feet. Time is eternal. It is a ribbon with no beginning and no end. The past is just a continuation of the future, and that ribbon is wrapped tightly around your present. So may this knowledge of tomorrow inform you, entertain you, and empower you with success today. Good night, my dearest friend, and may God help us in the future. Seriously, who writes this shit?